Hi, this is Kate. Welcome to Open to Analysis 101. Thank you for joining me. If you haven't subscribed, please do. Today's topic, guys, is the covert narcissist uh, custody and uh, visitation rights. The covert narcissist and custody and then the visitation rights. Now, you've, you know, you've gone to court and the court said, in the interest of the children, we need to, uh, they need to spend time with you and they need to spend time with, with them as well. So you, maybe you are the custodial parents and they have visitation uh, time. Um, and they made, they made this, the court obviously decides this on the, based on the fact that they want the children to be, um, to be both of you to be involved in the child's uh, life and the children's life so that's why you know if, even if you're the custodial parent or they or they happen to be the custodial parent that you get some time with the children and they have some time with the children um so again the court decides this based on the fact that so that you and the children will spend time so it's not you know the children don't you know you, as long as anyway as long as they want to spend time because most of the time <laughs> we see how that turns out um so the understanding is that the children are spending time with whoever that they are, the parents in you know, the time in you know, the position time is but what you realize with the covert narcissists and this is this of course uh, like everything else um the only reason why they wanted that time or they wanted the visitation they fight you tooth and nail for it in court is uh, just so they can win uh obviously by now you should know if you if you haven't you know you're not you've been dealing with them already or you're about to go into this you just know that this is just about um them winning something uh because they, they you know you, you can't get all the uh, all the stuff I, I need to get some some things on my own end as well so it just happens to be the time it doesn't mean that they are, they have all this elaborate plan of things or time they want to spend with their children that's not it never is it never is i mean if you live with them you know that that never really is what it is you know so the same thing applies so when they get the cost of the time or their visitation time um is just more about uh check mark check mark and I tell you this because when they, the, the understanding, like I said, from the court is to, to use the children to spend time with each parent, correct? But that's not what happens. And how you know this is you have different people or different, uh, yeah, different individuals that have nothing to do with you and the child, in the parenting or the co-parenting coming to take care of your children or picking up your children because it has never been about spending time with the children with the COVID narcissist. So you have either the, uh, the new supply or uh, the family member of the covert narcissist, as it is in my situation. Matter of fact, yesterday, that's what uh, uh, happened, is that the new supply uh, that's supposed to have been an ex supply is picking up the kids, but that's a different story. <laughs> you know, so um, they have a lot of people picking up because it's a check mark thing for them. Let me check off this on the checklist that this is done. Uh, they're never there. They're not there. So they can pick up the children, drop them off at the grandma's, pick up the children, drop them off at their mom's, pick up the children at their sisters or their brothers, or they have, they're not even in town. They're not in town at all. But this is how they understand what visitation is, is that just to make sure. Now, the option of saying, okay, um, you stay, which I, I'm not in town, which is what normally will happen, is that you're not in town, you're out of town. Okay, that means the children don't visit that time because you're not there. But because the covert nurse looks at this as uh, you uh, check mark over here, check mark over there, I have to win because if I don't show up, then that means that um, now you get more time than me. You know, even though I don't need anything to do, I have nothing to do, nothing planned, <laughs> you know, at all. But no, how, how, how dare you win? So now I'm going to send people that I barely know sometimes to come get the children so that that way it will be check marked off on my list that, yeah, uh -huh, you know, I, I got my two days. You know, so you don't, you don't, you don't get those two days. So that's how they look at visitation. That's how they look at uh, child custody right that they have is that it's a check mark. Then it's not really about spending time with the children. You can barely count uh, how many times they did, they do, they will spend time with the children. And even if the children show up there, they never really, um, there's nothing planned, especially for people that, uh, kids that show up in you know, a couple of days in a month, uh, nothing planned, nothing is ever planned. You think that they will, you know, I haven't seen my kids in a week. Let me do this. Let me do that. That never happens. You know, because it's never about that. It's about let me win, make sure you don't get it, you know, more time than me or whatever. Or let me check off this list of things that I did today. That's it. The they thought of, you know, spending time with the children doesn't even come into play. Even though it's called visitation time <laughs> or chat course at the time. That, 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 that doesn't factor with the covert narcissist. I just know this, you know, if you haven't experienced it yet or you're already going through it, you already understand. That's just how it is. You might have people that show up. Uh, 
that they barely know themselves to come get your children, unfortunately. And because the court said we have to share time uh, with these people, not knowing, of course, the, uh, the people we are dealing with are not emotionally stable, not psychologically well. But, you know, who's going to tell the court that? <laughs> All right, guys, get a hold of your mind and everything will fall into place. Please like and share. Thank you.